Hey y'all, welcome to another edition of Is It Bulletproof? I know you're probably thinking, uh, where's John? He usually does all this. Well, to be honest, I am on summer vacation and John's at work today. So, I decided to accept his challenge and do my own show of Is It Bulletproof? Um, I took Bullet today to PetSmart. We did some shopping, went up and down the aisles, for a good 20 minutes and came across this. Dun, 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 dun. It's Kong Scrunch. Um, John and I haven't ventured into the Kong section because we have a few Kongs that um, already work pretty well. Um, he's done a little bit of damage on them, um, but not much. They're stuff that we can keep out during the day and not worry about getting totally destroyed. Um, but they're the typical standard Kongs. Um, so I wanted to try the toys and see if they were just as durable. Um, this one says it squeaks and scrunches. Um, let's see. It's ideal for interactive or solo play. Durable construction for a long lasting fun. Um, so I wanted, since I have a little time on my hands, I wanted to give it a shot and see if it's bulletproof. Um, so far it looks pretty durable. It's some squeakers in there. Um, bullets outside and I bet if he hears it, he'll come coming through the door. <laughs> right on cue, boy. There's bullet. <laughs> so we're going to give it a try, see if it's bulletproof. Um, and I'll keep you posted. I'm excited to see what's up. All right, as you can see, Bullet heard the squeaks. He is ready to go. He loves his new toy. Bullet, if you love your new toy, lay down. 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 Good boy. If you love your new toy, up, up. Oh, he's excited. You ready? One, up. You gotta wait to catch it. One, two, three, catch it. All right, he's taking it to his designated spot. Let's see, is it bulletproof? All right, so we're back. It's 2.54. Um, as you can see, he was kind of ripping some little pieces of plastic on. Again, another reason why you should always supervise your pets. Because um, if they swallow these, um, it can really do a number on their intestines, and it's really not good for them. So, um, he's so good though. I was watching him the whole time. I'd tell him to drop it. He would spit it out. Um, this is what he did. There's just a little hole right there, but at about 16 minutes into it, he totally lost interest. And I think the Kong um, Crunch has a really good um, things going for it. I think the oblong shape along with the heavy duty plastic on the outside um, are two things that he just after a while, I was just tired of messing with it. Um, this isn't something, I wouldn't say it's totally bulletproof, because it's not something that I would feel comfortable leaving home all day, um, knowing that he's able to pull off these little pieces of plastic. And again, he's not gotten into the squeaker area, but I'm happy to, um, it still squeaks. Oh wait, maybe it doesn't. Well, it doesn't squeak anymore, <laughs> I guess since he put a hole in it, but um, it still makes the awesome crunchy noise. But, um, I, so I wouldn't really call it bulletproof, maybe bullet resistant, um, because it has, I mean, this is, I think, the first toy that we've given him that he's totally lost interest in, and um, at one point he was using it as a pillow. So, <laughs> 
kudos to Kong. They did a great job. Um, this is definitely one that I'd recommend for um, if you're interactively playing with them, it will last much longer, obviously. And um, he really enjoyed the squeaks and the crunches. Um, so he's a happy boy. He's still, come here, boy. Come here, boy. He's sitting here wagging his tail ready for another turn. Come here. Come get it. Come get it. Want to take it to your spot? Want to take it? Yeah. <laughs> and he's taking it back to his beds, so maybe for another round. So I'll keep y'all posted um, and see if it kind of, how long it actually lasts. But um, thanks for watching. Hope you like and subscribe. And if you have any ideas on um, any other toys that we could try, we may venture out more into the Kong department because um, he's definitely been pretty amused with it. But I was very impressed that he lost interest in it. And it might be because it doesn't have all the fuzz and fur and all that other stuff that he usually gets when, when John gets him his toys. But um, again, like and subscribe. Let us know what you think. Um, give us some feedback so that we can try different things with him. He um, totally loves his Is It Bulletproof time. Um, take care, and we'll see you soon.